I'm Julia, a product manager here at PagerDuty for Change Events. In case you're not familiar with Change Events, Change Events are a unique event in PagerDuty that help you track key changes such as deploys, build completions, and configuration updates, providing contextual information that is critical during incident triage. And today I'm excited to share with you a powerful new capability the team's been working on called our Custom Change Event Transformer. With the release of the custom change event transformer, we will enable seamless integration by allowing you to turn an event in any format from your integrated tools into a pager duty change event. So let's go ahead and take a look at how it works. I'll hand off to Shayun, a developer on our team, to walk you through a step by step demo. Hello, here is a quick demo of the new custom change event transformer integration. So on this new demo service, if I go to integrations, I can add a new integration. And on that form, so let's call this my custom change event transform. We now have a new dropdown for custom change event transformers. I'll click add integration. And once that's done, we can go back to the list of our integrations. Clicking on this, I can see more information about my custom change event transformer. So here is a look at the JavaScript. This is pretty basic. Um, so anytime I send a request to this particular endpoint, it's gonna create, it's gonna run this JavaScript to create my custom change event. So let's try that, why don't we? I'm gonna copy this link and come here And then I'm going to click send and send a payload. And here I get change event process success. Awesome. So let's go to the recent changes page here. And we should be able to see our change event on the new demo service. So if we come here, here we go. Custom change event transform. Awesome. Now this is a lot more <laughs> information than we need. Uh, if we don't want to show this much detail, we can always go back to the service and go back to our integration right here. And we can edit the JavaScript and make sure that, you know, it's it doesn't put all everything that has to do with the request into the payload. So yeah, that's it. You go to new demo service, activity, you can also see the most recent activity here, recent change that was created using the custom change event transformer. So yeah, that's it. Uh, feel free to check out documentation if you'd like to know more about custom change event transforms. Thanks.